and it's uh, uh, the appointed official, uh, and I, I emphasize appointed official, that is uh, uh, Madam Chair Wolseley. And uh, of course, Regina Barnes took that seat in an election and uh, is now sitting with us, and we're proud to have her. But uh, the chairperson of the Budget Committee is appointed and is not elected by the people of Hampton. Uh, during uh, her last tenure as a selectman, I asked her to uh, have her email blocked from my account because she continuously, and up until this date, and there's emails right here, violates uh, uh, what would be the appropriate uh, term. She, she copies everybody, and it's essentially holding a meeting. Uh, town Council has briefed all of the boards and committees in this town about that. But she sends out emails consistently. Last week, I believe I spoke to you, Mr. Welch, sure. to have her uh, email blocked <clears throat> from my account. I do not want to participate in activities that are illegal by statute in the state, state of New Hampshire. I would encourage anyone that's receiving these emails from uh, Madam Wolseley uh, to not, uh, not accept them because it is a violation of, of state law. And they are myriad, they are ongoing. She does not listen to the town council. She doesn't listen to the town manager. She won't listen to the statutes. And uh, she continues up until this day, up until this week, to violate that state law. So I just wanted to raise that issue. If we're going to uh, air our laundry, as, um, as um, perhaps Madam Wolsey wants to do, um, I just wanted to add that on the record, that there is a continuing violation of, essentially, uh, meetings being held online with a town asset with town email accounts, and I want no part of it. Thank you, Mr. Chairman.